Hi, this is Craig from Silcata Grove. I'm here with Valerie today, and we are going to be giving a second chance to Malika. Um, I had a Malika treat myself. I grew fruit on it. Uh, I had fruit for about three years, and just it never was good. Malika is one that's very unique in that you have to pick it ripe green and then ripen it uh, indoors. Um, the problems I've, of all the times I've had them, I've only had one that was ever really good, and it was really good, but all the other ones turned out poorly. So, uh, I picked one up from Mango Man of Florida over in, uh, Mango Man of Homestead, uh, on the East Coast, and some mangoes grow a little different on the East Coast than they do over here on the West Coast of Florida. So we're going to give this one another try. Um, I had this one. The other thing I tried doing, I used to ripen them. Uh, bring them inside to try to ripen them on the counter in the air conditioning. I think that doesn't work. And so the next time I tried ripening them out in my garage, which is probably way too hot. So now I'm starting to do it out on a screen porch, um, which is where this one was ripened, and we're going to see if that makes a difference. Um, plus, somebody who's better at determining ripe green picked this one That's than normal. me. It smells, but it smells kind of... Well, that smells a little better. I know the last time when I reviewed Malika, if I reviewed Malika before, it wasn't good. I'm not, like I said, I've not had good ones, but I know it's a good variety because it's just, it's way too popular and you have to go through way too much trouble uh, to ripen them for it not to be a good mango, so... It all reminds me of something, like maybe a candy or something. I just can't well, picture it. Let's a... give it a try. Tastes better than it smells. It's 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 good. Um, it's it's just it's just not amazing. It's um. Yeah. It tastes like a mango, and then it has like a little bit of an. Oh, well, it's got a little bit of a lemony that. flavor to it. Yeah. It does have some lemony to it. It's got some... It's got a little bit of a mustiness. Um, not overpowering musty like some of the other ones have, have but... The texture is very nice. It is very sweet. Um, It's just, it doesn't have, anybody, Celeste, you want to see if you can put a name on this flavor? Kind of like that pink on fluoride. The pink on fluoride was. I, when I was a kid, the pink on fluoride tasted really bad, and so it wasn't like this. I think Armalika's a little bit better than this one. Our one from last year, we had one that last year. Well, we had one good one last year, and I had a whole bunch that just did terrible. And most of them actually rotted uh, while waiting to ripen out in the hot garage because I think it just was way too hot. This side has a lot more. The fun. one I did have last time, last year of mine, it was good. It was really good. I mean, it was. I guess that's what they're supposed to taste like. I just. I don't know. To me, it's there's. It, if the ripening is this complex, I cut my tree down. Um, I was going to top work it with something else just because if it's that hard to get them to do right. I figured it just wasn't worth it. A lot of people feel differently. I know this is like one of the most popular Indian mangoes. And Besides one lemon just meal. lemony is to me is, is the main flavor. I mean other than mango. Yeah this mango is really picky compared to like a lemon meringue or something that's just like always good. Yeah um Brooke, what do you think? It's alright. It has a strange aftertaste. Yeah, that, that's that. I'm calling that musty flavor. Um, and it is. It comes in as an aftertaste. It's not bad. Um, again, maybe I'm not ripening these properly. Um, this one was mostly ripened by someone else. So, I mean, I gave it a few more days and it got soft. It got the right color. It's got some good smell. Um... Do you want another piece, Mom? It's just, it's just not all that good. I'd give it a seven, though. I mean, it's, it's, I'll eat the rest of this. I'll suck off the seed. Uh, 
You always may play well unless well, it's Well, unless it's bad, bad I won't bother with the seed, but it's good enough to get the get the rest of the Or if you have plant. a lot of mangoes, you probably will not either take the seeds unless it's great. So. There's, I guess, a little bit of fiber little, in that. A little so more lemony it. towards the seed. So I could tell there's a lot of fiber when you're cutting seeds. Well, there's always some near the seeds, but... No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna badmouth the Malika because I know it must be good, or people wouldn't make such a fuss over it. So um, for me, I just I'm still waiting to have a good one, uh, except that one that we had last year. So I, I'm gonna leave it at a seven until I, uh, I guess maybe till I learn to ripen them properly. But um, anyway, so that's the Malika. Uh, I'm sure some of you have had better ones. And I'm sure there's better ones out there, but uh, for me, I'm leaving it at a seven. So, what would you give it? Six or a seven. Six or seven. Okay. Well, there you have it. Uh, that's it for today. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll talk to you next time. Pick the mango from the tree, and the mango down to me. Put the mango in a...